Hello everyone, before going into today's video, I want you to know that I released on Mobile Fire a massive Talia guide with over 30 pages of content, over 40 matchups and over 30 synergies with information on runes, builds, win conditions, roaming, gang pets and much much more. You have the link in the description below and feel free to check it out whenever you need help and uh, leave an upvote if it did help you. I will also answer all the questions you have guys in the comments or on Discord or wherever you want and I'll also be there for you if you need me. Thank you very much and let's go to the video. Welcome welcome everyone to episode 2 of Diamond Adventures. We are here in Diamond 2 against an Echo on mid which have swapped places with Goku Kha'Zix, which is a Kha'Zix OTP. Now they do have the classic, possibly extremely bad early Vayne and Janna, and the Kane top lane that no one knows about, or no one even thinks about. So yeah, basically I believe Kain top is a bit of a troll pick, but maybe if he plays well, he'll be able to actually win against that, against that Camille. Now, I want to play with Corrupting Potion because they have Teleport, I'm playing with Biscuit Delivery and Time Warp Tonic and Relentless Hunter instead of the Hill one, the Ravenous Hunter. So we're getting that, we're getting there and let me just do this, okay. Let's go guys. Poor, poor Janna. Only three flashes for that. <laughs> oh, two flashes, well. We should, we should fight. We should try to fight there. I need to close Firefox. Wait. Also, in the early game I tend to wear this, you should also wear this. Oh, that's a situation. Coming, I'm far away. Can you not die till I get there? was a mistake. Okay. Okay. That went well. Sorry that I didn't comment on that, but <laughs> kinda lost track. What is Kha'Zix even doing? Oops. Well, that's CS. And that one. Oh my god, I cannot take every CS here. Now, I have to recall that Sabius. But at least let me push this into his tower. So, yeah, that's fine. Uh, actually, I won't recall because I need to get some corrupting potion stack of him first. Electroco didn't proc there, should have procced. But yeah, we actually did a pretty good fight there. Uh, as you can see, he actually used now one stack of corrupting potion, so it's good. He wants that, so I'll give him that. Especially since Kha'Zix is there. And we're interested in that and that. Okay, so we're like 9 CS behind. But 
we don't mind that, do we? Okay, now we can kill him. We can easily kill him now. Especially since Ignite comes up soon. Just to, we just gotta be careful to that gank of Kha'Zix whenever that happens. So we establish that we lost the CS battle. Okay, dodge that. Dodge the reverse. Okay, proking electrocute. Okay, that was a defensive W there. Boy, he can do nothing now. Love this. And he has no teleport, he has no posh potions. We just we just push obnoxiously hard now because we cannot really die to that Kazix unless we fuck up greatly. Oh, come on. That's just sad. So we basically fucked up greatly, as we said. I mean, I expected that Kha'Zix to come. I just really did. But him living with 13 HP, come on, how often does that happen? But we don't mind much. Kha'Zix killed me, so... He'll be a bit stronger, that's clear. But we can kill him again. And why would you even pick Kain if you cannot win lane? Uh, let's be honest. Probably he has, yeah, he has no teleport either. I'm just gonna push this quick. And we're gonna move forward on bot lane. Yeah, we can force a plate there, especially if Kha'Zix tries to gang. No, no, I found the... Yeah, I've seen it. Okay. Should buy a vision ward as well. But we have prior on this one, so that's great. He made six as well. That one, damn it. Let's hope I don't lose this one too. Okay. So this guy is dead. We have more of the speed we can just walk here. Okay. Solve that problem. Three biscuits, by the way, we can can do a lot with three biscuits. Yeah, push this fast. How did Kha'Zix escape? Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Lol. 
that was an abandonment. Qu quickly out vein jumping. It's a bad idea to actually do to actually do Drake here because we're all low HP and we need the reset. I'm gonna for these boots for faster movement speed. I wanna roam, I don't care about mid game, late game I want. I want to win now and I am quite doing that. Now there's a problem. If Rakan dies there. Okay that's <laughs> Thank you, John, I suppose. Okay, I get that. Excellent. Maybe should have not. Maybe should have not flashed there, but there was no other option, honestly. And he didn't ult. Because he didn't have time to ult. Oh. Run, boy, run. Maybe I would have, maybe I need 300 gold more, but we can recall now for refill doesn't matter. We just need to keep on farm ahead, on, we need to keep overhead on the farm, okay? Whenever you're against an echo, if he gets a shit ton of farm on top of you or ahead of you, you're going to lose. Now top lane is winning, winning clearly, pretty much clearly. So as it's expected against the frigging cane, but still uh, I ruined that, yes now I am going to die next ga next gank of Kha'Zix if I'm not careful so uh, never mind maybe should have pinged that he's missing or we can go bot now we see Kha'Zix top, okay? you understand where he is I also understand that we can gang mod now. I don't think that Vision World has seen me. Okay, this worked. I don't know why Vayne walked into the farm range there. But I think I did great. Now, Silas might die, I don't care. Alright. And this guy probably wins. Never mind, she's dead. But it was totally worth it because we got two kills on bot. I mean, Vayne should not get caught in my spell, that's obvious. And here I can actually ult to save my plates. Maybe even, who knows. Okay, like this. That's how you do it. Probably dead now. Doesn't matter. Good. Two kills for one. I mean, maybe more. Oh, that's excellent. Excellent. There is a vein coming though, I think. So we also got advantage here, even actually did a good play by killing Kazakhs. 
I mean, the good play here was from my uh, actual jungler for coming here. But I got the kill. They got the shot down on me, but we got two kills, so it's it adds up. It works. It eventually works. Also, I feel that full W on Vayne before, it was amazing. Now I'm going up absolutely the standard build as you can see here. Not really caring much. Going for some cooldown reduction. Okay, this is nice. I think they are doing this. They are not doing this. I want that Janna, I want to kill her. And there is no one on the map who can actually catch me here. Vayne might be coming. Okay. Where, where is Vayne? Come on, where is Vayne? I'm staying to defend for that Vayne, but I don't see her anywhere. Okay, found her. Good. Uh, not sure if that was some crap play because if Kain killed them both, we would have lost. But I suppose playing the anti Vayne game worked because I believe Vayne is 10 times stronger than Kain in this context. That was horrendous. Okay, I see an Echo W coming in. We back off, we could back off. Okay, they're going to die apparently. This is OP, right here. Okay, we're going to die, all of us, if we don't run. Luckily we escaped. I escaped. They're certainly not going to catch me with that movement speed, but we did. It's kind of bad that we gave them so many shutdowns there. We could also turn into a herald there. She just got a tower. <laughs> and she's higher level than their mid laner. Well, I suppose mid and bot went well this game. Even top, honestly. This for the Janna and the Vayne heal, even the Echo heal. Yeah, all of them has heals. So we gonna get these I mean this build kind of works if you're ahead in CS I, I wanted the quick gold there the quick uh, how can I say boots upgrade so that's why I went for this could have not bought these boots but it would set me up in uh, movement speed it uh, would take much more Time for me to actually continue and go next in the item hierarchy. Why did not why I did not go for that vein honestly? She didn't even notice that I'm here. Got him! Nice predicts. Take the star, please. Um. 
I wanted to do a predict on his jump, but apparently his jump was, well, disastrous. That was an actually nice. That was an actually nice uh, ultimate from Silas. And yeah, we. I want. I want that vein. That uh, Jana. What is this? No! Ah, I got those blades! Never mind. <laughs> Look at these items. So, yeah, this went well. Starting from level 1 to here. Actually, went generally well. Why do you back off? I mean, you could just win the game. Okay, so we play for KD, I guess. Hmm. How do we finish this? We just ult, I just ult and win. Okay, and Echo, <laughs> Echo just did that, so... Wait me. I mean you could easily win three versus four there. Okay, let's get kills. That went well. Thank you for watching and sorry for the low commentary rate of this video. I'm actually a bit tired and uh, it gets it gets hard to make these videos if I have a full week. So I'm trying my best to get you some content, guys. And I will try to do another video this week if my head doesn't randomly explode, as it might happen in some cultures. Don't know which cultures, but. <laughs> Anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this and see you next time guys. I love you all. Goodbye.